Hi, I would like to present the Mindtest Mod Beduino. Beduino is a computer simulation to be programmed in a C-like programming language. The mod has four blocks, controller, I.O. module, router, and broker. In addition you need the programmer and the server from the mod VM16. The programmer provides the programming environment with editor, compiler, and debugger. The server is used as file system for provided examples, but also for your own files. The controller has no direct user interface, you have to use the programmer to be able to interact with the controller. Place the server somewhere and connect the programmer with the server and with the controller by left clicking on both blocks. Now place the programmer somewhere and open the menu. On the left you see the splash screen of the programmer, on the right the files of the file server. Press the init button to search for I.O. modules nearby, valid range is 3 blocks. There is nothing connected so far. Now we open the first example by double clicking on the file name. Example 1 outputs some characters to the status line of the programmer. It uses a for loop from 0 to 32 to generate and output the characters. The file can be executed with the buttons debug and run. By means of the button step, single lines can be executed. The status line shows the character's output. The watch window shows the current value of variables in hexadecimal and decimal representation. With the halt command in the loop function. The program stops automatically as soon as all characters have been output and the loop function is run through for the first time. To generate a new file, enter the file name in the text field and press new. You can copy the code from any example as template with control C and paste the lines with control V into the new file. Don't forget to press the save button. Now you can change and save the code for your own projects. Oops, this will not work. The compiler shows an error message. With the compile button, the assembly output is shown, and stored in the file out.asm. Now I will show the next example. For that we need the I.O. module block. Each I.O. module needs a unique base port, which is used from your program to select the block-related I.O. ports, for input and output commands. Example 2 needs a button on port 0 and a signal tower on port 1.
Each I.O. module has 8 I.O. ports to be connected with you Tech Pack or Tech Age machines. To connect the port with your machine, enter the Tech Pack or Tech Age node number into the text fields. The menu shows for each port the current input and output state, and the name of the connected block. To be able to receive the signals from the button, enter the I.O. module number into the menu of the button. Now you can see the button signals. An off signal is translated to the value 0, an on signal to the value 1. At least, you have to connect the controller to the I.O. module by clicking the init button again. Now you can run example 2 and start and stop the running light with the button. With a double click on a code line you can set a breakpoint. The program will stop the execution every time, it reaches this line. Other buttons for instance allow to step into a function or return from a function. The program uses the define IO underscore green. This and other I.O. module related defines and functions are shown in the I.O. module help page. That's for today. Have fun with the mod Biduino.